Uh, regarding the condition of the person who's performing etigaf, is he or she allowed to leave the confines of the mosque? Normally, while doing etikaf, a person should not leave the mosque. If he leaves the mosque, he breaks the principle of etikaf, and the etikaf is invalidated. But in case of emergency, if there is a need, then he can leave. For example, if a person wants to go for a call of nature, if he wants to go to leave himself, or if he wants to do wudu, or do guzul, or to have a bath, or wash himself, or if there is no one who can get food for him in the mosque, and if he has to go to eat, he's allowed to go out to get food. So, unless it's a basic necessity, it's a need. As is mentioned in Sahih Bukhari, volume number three, in the book of Atikaf, hadith number 2029, the Hazrat Aisha Allah be pleased with her, she says, the Prophet, while doing Atikaf, never entered the house unless it was for a need. So if it's necessity is allowed, otherwise in the normal circumstances, you should not leave the mosque. And if you have to leave for a basic necessity, you have to come back fast, as soon as possible. But nowadays, Alhamdulillah, many mosques, or most of the mosques, they have a toilet attached to the mosque, they have a bathroom attached to it, and the wudu is inside the mosque. So there are less requirements to go out of the mosque. And furthermore, the wife of the Prophet, Hazrat Aisha Mellavipidita, she said, it's mentioned in Sunnah Abu Dawud, volume number two, in the book of fasting, hadith number 2467, that a person who does etikaf, it is the sunnah of etikaf that he should not visit a patient or attend a funeral or embrace the wife or have relationship with the wife and should not leave the mosque unless for a basic necessity. Here we come to know that while doing etikaf, it is not a sunnah. It's not allowed that you should visit a person who's sick or visit a relative or go out for family needs or for earning money or for a funeral. And except for a basic need, you should not leave the mosque. Okay, that seems to be quite clear in terms of the, the basic requirements of itikaf.